Hello everybody, my name is Omar Garcia and today I'll be showing you how to set up an external backup job on the QNAP. We're going to start by opening up QFinder to help me locate the NAS on my network. Once it locates it, I'm going to double click on it to open it in the web browser. And I'll go ahead and log in. First thing we're going to do when we log into the QNAP is verify that our external storage device is detected. Go to Control Panel, System Settings, External Device, and under External Storage, you'll see that your device will be detected. Mine shows up as USB Disk 1 and it is formatted as NTFS, and it shows three, over 3 gigabytes of free space. Now I'm going to go ahead and open up File Station to see the folders that I'm going to be backing up. So click, go back here to click on the desktop, open a file station. If you don't see file station, you can hit the three horizontal bars to the left, which is the main menu, and open a file station under applications. The folder I'm going to be backing up is under public, and it's called external backup. So if I go to public, external backup, you'll see that I have a document in here called 2015 holidays. I'm going to be backing that up to USB disk 1, which is my external storage device, and the test folder, which is currently empty. To set up that external backup job, we're going to need to go to Backup Station. There's a couple ways you can get there. You can go back to the desktop, and you, if you have an icon for Backup Station, you can access it there, or you can go to the three horizontal, horizontal bars again, select it, and select Backup Station from there, or you can access it from the Control Panel, Go to Applications, Backup Station. Now in Backup Station, we're going to set up the, drive, the backup job under External Backup by selecting External Drive. Now we'll go ahead and select the option to create a job. It'll pop, prompt us with a wizard. It'll help us create the job. Click Next. Now it's asking you to select the disk volume. So go ahead and select the volume from the drop down. Ours is going to be USB disk 1. And now it's going to default to create this backup from local disk to external storage. We're going to be backing up the data from the QNAP to the external storage device. Go ahead and click next. Now it's asking us for the folder pairs. So we're going to do that folder called external backup under public. So now we need to find that location, public, external backup, click the green arrow. Now the destination folder is on the external storage device. So we need to go to USB disk 1, and the folder was test. Now click add, and verify you've added the correct folder pair. Click next. Now we're going to set this up to replicate now. If you want to set, change the schedule, you can change the options here to run hourly, daily, weekly, or monthly. For now, we're just going to set to replicate now. Click Next. You can enter a name for the backup job. We'll just leave it as a default. And click Next. Verify your settings. Click Next. And now the job is complete. It's been finished. So click Finished. And now you can verify right here. Click on the arrow. Verify your job is running. We only have that one small document, so as you can see, the job finished right away. Now, if we go back to File Station, click Refresh. We're currently in USB Disk 1 test folder. Click Refresh, and now you can see that document shows up. And that shows that your backup completed successfully. And it's just as easy as that. 